Welcome to Marine Tech Hub. Uh, today I will explain about treadmill testing. Uh, this is the part 2 of the video. So in the treadmill we have the three phase injection motor and we have the VFD and uh, we have the control console. This is HMI human interface machine interface where we give the control to increase or decrease the RPM so first of all I have tested the motor it's ok and uh, this drive also I have checked this is ok only problem we had was the signal which we have to give through the through the keypad the keypad is not working so we are giving manually here the signal by using a jumper so I will be showing in the part two, part three of the video, the keyboard and how we are going to rectify. So now the supply is given. You can measure the voltage here in this board here. It should be 4.3 volt. I will just run the video for you and give the signal to increase the uh, speed of the motor. So I will just run the video for you so you can see we are giving right now the signal here you can see here once you touch you get the signal okay. then so you you can see I am telling we are starting the thing system you can see here the number 3 2 1 you see this is started rotating so this is rotating and uh, it's working now I want to increase the the speed of this to different rpm you see the this is rotating i am going to increase the speed you can see here i am by i'm using a jumper wire to just activate activate the switch to increase the frequency so the rpm increases so if you have any if you have any doubt regarding this you can always message me so one important thing is this control board should be working so otherwise the output will not come from the frequency drive because once the supply is coming here then you are giving signal to increase the frequency or decrease first you have to give a start signal then start rotating uh, at different speed level the rpm will be different so if you have any doubt regarding this let me know and if you like the video please subscribe thank you